Hi guys, welcome to Sim UK. This is The Climb, and this has to be one of the most amazing games that I've experienced on VR so far. You can play with the control pad, or you can use the touch controllers. You can sit down and play it, or you can stand up. I think if you stand up, it just feels more realistic. But um, yeah, so I've almost completed Bay on the easy level. But uh, for this video, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do the practice, and at the end, I'll do a bit of bay. Um, this game's pretty good in terms of nausea element, but there are bits that can throw you. So um, I'll try not to get nausea, but uh, if I do, I'll have to stop early. But we'll do the practice, and uh, so you guys can see what this is. Now, let's do the basic tutorial so you can understand what the premise is. So this hey is the there, wall climbers. in front of me. Welcome to our touch controller tutorial. This As you one's can see, for learning the basics. The climb. First, try looking around. Notice how your hands move with the position of your touch controllers. As you climb, you need to be aware of your stamina. The amount of stamina for each hand is displayed on the hand itself. The blue. Okay, to take hold of a grip, use your left or right grip control. Each control maps directly to the hands you see. The distance you are from the wall depends on how far your touch controllers are from your body. Try this out by moving your touch controllers backwards and forwards. The hand that holds onto a grip loses stamina, while the one that is not holding gains stamina. While so, you lose stamina, you start to sweat. Your heartbeat increases and your hands start to tremble. When your stamina is depleted, you will fall. You can improve stamina by chalking your hands. If your hands are chalked, your stamina drains slower and regains faster. Yep. Chalk your right hand by holding the chalk button and shaking the controller. A sound will inform you once chalking is complete. Chalk your left hand with the left chalk button. The status of your chalk is displayed on each hand. The white bit. Hold on to the grip again and see how stamina drains more slowly now. Grip with both hands to regain stamina. You see how it uses all the white as well as the blue? Stamina. Chalk depletes as you climb with every grip you touch. Less chalk means you lose stamina faster and regain it more slowly. Now look up and find the checkpoint flag. This shows you where the section ends. Great. Now try climbing higher. First, let's get to the save point. Hold on to a grip and push or pull yourself in the direction you want to move. I'm even doing the noises. Did you hear that? <laughs> that wasn't You're intentional. Doing really well. You've reached a save point. If you fall out, this is this, the save point here. This thing. Back here. All right. Looks like we're going this way. Some grips are just out of reach. Try stretching your arms to get to this one. Which Holding one? a grip that's too far from your body can decrease stamina. <sighs> okay. You can also lean your body to get those really difficult <sighs> Alrighty, so far so good. Some climbs are quite complex. If you get lost, <sighs> press the hint button to see your route. Huh, looks like you need to get around this corner. Try leaning your body around it. That there <laughs> is where the nausea comes in. Oh. Yeah, that's where the nausea comes in, when it, like, spins around you like that. Again, lean your body to look around the corner. Oof! Nearly there, guys. But this bit is tricky as hell. Some grips can only be reached by jumping. Press the jump button to leap in the direction you are looking. Yeah. Remember, you need to release the grip button to grab the new grip. Yeah. You also lose stamina by jumping or falling. Ready? 
Oh, oh I missed them. That's where the nausea comes in as well. Right. Ready? You can also jump by looking into the direction you want to go and pushing yourself off from the wall. Release the hand you've pushed with and re you've reached the... Before jumping, make sure your body is... Congratulations! Remember. Ah, uh -huh. so that's the tutorial, guys. Now, um... The advanced tutorial discusses different types of grips that Welcome are available. Welcome to our advanced tutorial for touch controls. Here, you'll learn about some of the more challenging skills you need to master. First, let's get to the save point. Stamina drains more quickly on technical grips than on like normal this. grips. See this? You can maintain stamina by holding the trigger about halfway to max. Try it until you find the correct range. So very gently on the controls. It gives me more time. Crumbling grips won't Oof. hold for long. So make sure you know your path before starting. Now, this looks pretty easy as it is. Clean these ledges to get a secure grip. Hold down the grab button and wipe off the dirt until the grip has been cleaned completely. Afterwards, you need to grab it again to get a grip. Oh, that took forever. Right, now this is tricky as hell. This really is tricky. Toxic grips affect your stamina in a negative way. So basically there's nothing you can do about this. It's just gonna hurt. It's okay, so get on with it. Get it done, get it over and done with. Ah, I couldn't chalk, I couldn't do it. I couldn't chalk in time. Right. Go on, let me up. Uh, what's the problem? You can use the rewind button once per climb to move yourself back to the last checkpoint. Let's do that now. That's it. Well done. You've completed our advanced tutorial. And there it is. So, I mean, that looks pretty unrealistic. But let me just show you a little bit of the bay and you'll see how realistic this game is. The reason why the tutorial is like that is so that you can have a good understanding of the game before you get into the game. The game itself is, I think, incredibly, incredibly realistic. How's that for a view, guys? See bugs? Butterflies. <clears throat> you've got leopards. You've got, I don't know, lots of stuff. Lots of stuff to put you off. Let's go. Technical grip. Recharge. Don't actually know where I'm going. Oh, over there. So you can go either way, look. I think this is the more advanced route. Let's go this way. Oh. How are we doing for chalk? That is quite tricky up there, isn't it? Oh! Not good. 
How am I going to re-chalk here? Right, good, okay. That was close. You never really think about bugs being a, an issue when you're rock climbing, but I bet you it is. And just playing this game does make your arms ache. It, you really do get a good sense of rock climbing. Ah, just brought up the menu there by accident. These are very technical holds. Okay, there's the point. Okay, why can't I get up here? <sighs> Pretty intense stuff guys, and I do feel like I'm standing up here on a ledge. Trying to ring the bell, but I don't think I can. So, guys, listen. Just figure out where the camera is. Uh, that's all I can show you today because I'm starting to feel nauseous already. But I've been playing all day, so um, I'm already a bit shaky before I started. But this is uh, the climb, and it is absolutely incredible. No two words about it. Two ways about it. I'm a bit exhausted, a little bit, but. Um, I love this game, I think it's fantastic. And this is the easy level, by the way. This is easy, easy peasy stuff. It gets a lot harder, I can assure you. Anyway, take care, till next time, goodbye.